Alright guys, welcome back to part one of our playthrough through Kingdom Come Deliverance. Uh, it was free this week on Epic Games Launcher. If you, if you don't have it yet, I'll check it out. Because every so often they have free to, like free games that they give away that are actually like real free games. And I've been wanting to play this game for a while, so... I don't know if it'll get viewers or not, but I actually want to play this game, so I figured I'd make a video while I do it. Successful reign. The empire he ruled from Prague expanded, and his subjects lived in peace and prosperity. When the emperor died, the whole empire mourned. More than 7,000 people accompanied him on his last procession. The heir to the throne of the flourishing empire was Charles's son. Wenceslas IV, whose father had prepared him for this moment all his life. Oh, that chick's necky. Did not God. His father. Lord. He neglected affairs of state for more frivolous pursuits. He even failed to turn up for his own coronation as emperor, Ooh. which did little to endear him to the Pope. What a loser. Wenceslas the Idol did not impress the imperial nobility either. His difficulties mounted until the nobles, exasperated by the inaction of their ruler, turned for help to his half-brother, King Sigismund of Hungary. Looks like a badass. King Sigismund looks like a fierce. Sigismund decided on a radical solution. He Murder. The king. Oh. To force him to abdicate. That dude got a sword then straight through his head. Of the oh, shit. Disorder <laughs> to gain greater power for himself. He invaded Bohemia with a massive army. Perhaps and began city. pillaging the territories of the king's allies. It is here that my story begins. What about my story? When does my story begin? Ah, new game. I hear this game's really hard, so we're gonna keep it on normal mode. I hear this is like an insanely hard game, so I don't even know if I'll get through it, but I've been meaning to play it for a while, and it coming up free is just more reason. The early 15th century was a time of turmoil in the Holy Roman Empire, which had flourished under the Emperor Charles IV, but now with his son, Wenceslas the Idol, on the Bohemian throne was falling into disarray. The king's inactivity angered many of nobility, as well as his half-brother, King Sigismund of Hunger- Ah, uh, too fast. He decided to do something, something, something about the Empire. Something, something, something. Look at that rabbit! He's hiding Easter eggs! What is that? Elk? Or deer? Or... It's a deer. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot! <laughs> Silver Scallets, 1403. Before Columbus crossed the ocean blue. Wah, 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 wah. Kingdom come deliverance. Yeah. I'm actually super excited. Let's go. This is pretty. This game is really beautiful. My horse, my horse is amazing. Ah, am I a miner? Cool. Oh, no, I'm not. We're just looking around the whole world, apparently. Eventually, we'll find me. This is not me. Such splendor. A great sugar substitute. Where am I? God bless. Same to you. Today's a scorch. It's hot. That's what she said. That was ye old for it's hot out here. Where's AC? Am I the basket woman? We seem to be following the basket woman. Well, husband, how goes it? It goes Oof. right. I should get it finished today. Where on earth is Henry? I need him to run some errands. He was still sleeping when I went out. At this hour? 
blue-blooded idler. Well, it looks like he was out all evening, drinking like a lord. Hey. <laughs> you go and get the lazy bones up then. Quick clout round the Smack that. Mm -hmm. Out on the floor, slap that. <laughs> Where am I? Am I Henry the idler? Blue-blooded? It's me. Get up now. I can feel There's it. Work to be done. We haven't seen his face yet because character customization. Maybe. <sighs> Never mind. Get up or I'll come get you up, you slug of egg. Hear that? You'd better not vex him. No, All right. get up quick. Your breakfast is on the table. Wait, what's this? Have you been Oh, Henry. Oh, How Henry. many times have I told you about fighting? Oh, it's nothing. It's just it's a scratch. You've been at that sword play again, haven't you? You'd better pray your father doesn't get to hear of it. I want to be a knight. You know how he feels about it. I don't worry, it wasn't that. I, I just scratched myself is all. Hmm. Well, hmm. just don't come crying to me if you really do get hurt. Now get up, you rogue. Our humble beginnings as Henry Wounded Hand. Uh, gameplay? Uh, black screen? Game broke? Rip? Oh, loading screen. A fine state you're in this morning. What on earth did you get up to last night? Partying. Uh, by means of the first two dialogue choices in this, oh god, by means of the first two choices in this dialogue, you will select your character's default characteristics. If you're not satisfied with them, not to worry, all characteristics can be further developed without limitations. Ah, I was with Bianca, ho ho ho. I like strength, I'm more of a strength guy. I was working in the forge! I was sweating in the forge all day yesterday. And then I was helping Fritz and Matthew with some errands. So I'd say I have a right to be a bit tired. Well, I've got a feeling there's something you're not a new main level. And it's connected with that scratch on your hand. And that suspicious looking character with a sword who turned up in town recently. Uh, kind of want to do some agility as well. But, uh... Muy fuerte. So I'm learning to sword fight. And what of it? What harm does it do? At least I'll be able to defend myself. I'm a warrior. God above, Hal. You know how your father will react when he finds out. How? What's he going to do? I'm doing nothing wrong. I just wanted to try it. On your own head be it then. I can't stop you. And you can deal with your father on your own. Don't come looking to me for help. I'm super strong. Catch these hands. Go to the sword fighting lesson. Let's just do all the options. You and Fritz come looking for me. No, I haven't seen them this morning. They shouldn't be hard to find. They'll be hanging around a tavern somewhere, as usual. Uh. It's unfair. They're... Really? <laughs> so where were you until the small hours last night? Partying. With Bianca, of course. You mean at Bianca's tavern? And who was there with you? It was no, Bianca. don't tell me. Let me guess. Matthew and Fritz. Well, at least you were with Bianca. You should hold on to that one, Hal. She's a clever girl. And invite her for supper sometime. Your father's very fond of her. Of course he is. He thinks he'll be able to wheedle the secret of beer brewing out of her. <laughs> You're right there. You'd think he was planning to become a brewer in his dotage. Still, that's your father for you. At least he's interested in something, unlike you lot. Hmm. You're too busy getting into mischief to do an honest day's work. If Fritz and Matthew carry on this way, they'll wind up swinging one day. You mark my words. Father angry with me for sleeping late. Probably. He's not happy. 
Yesterday you promised him you'd help finish that sword for Saratsik. He's not as young as he was. And you know how his joints pain him. He's too proud to complain. But he needs your help, Henry. Ah, oh, we're a scumbag. Don't ah, worry feels now. bad. Of course I'll help him. Good. He always says his knees ache when there's a storm coming. I hope they're wrong this time. It's looking like such a nice day. I'm hungry. Get something to eat? I left some breakfast on the table. Help yourself. Do you need me to do anything, Ma? Ah, you're a good lad. But I'm fine. It's your father needs helping with that sword. All right. You talked me into it. We got a perk point, though. How do I do that? Ah. Stuff. Player. Main level, we're level two. Uh, our strength is high. What is a perk point? What is this? What does this mean? Uh, Q. Carrying dead or unconscious bodies won't cost you any stamina, and the burden you only have- Why would I be carrying dead bodies? This is cool, you can level up and stuff? That's pretty dope. I hear it's so hard though. Defense increases the time you hold a perfect block. I probably should wait on this until later. Let's not do this right now. Eat the cheese! Oh yes. Cheese. To eat food, pick it up. I hope there's not like a survival gauge or something. Ah, oh, it takes my energy away. Yeah, we'll keep it for right now. I think we should be fine. Uh, or let's eat one, maybe. Okay. Punch the door. I think we went the wrong way. I'm lost! Hooray! Look, it's so sunny and nice outside. Go to father. The compass will tell you where the, to go into the qu in the quest you are pursuing. Just head for the active waypoint. Oh God! Don't hurt me. Come here. I need your help. I'm here. At least you're up. That's a start. Anyway, we have a lot of work to do today. I'm finishing the sword for Sir Radzik, and I need your help. With what? I'm running out of charcoal. Run to the market and buy a bag from the charcoal burner. I'll need some money then. Yeah, that's the other thing. Kunesh still owes me for an axe, oh, this is a, a hammer, and the quest. nails I sold him a month ago. Not to mention his debt from before. Go and tell him to pay up, at least for the axe and hammer, and then use the money to buy the charcoal. Kunesh? That drunkard? <laughs> That'll be fun. <laughs> well, you're a big lad now. I'm sure you can manage. If not, tell him that next time I'll come myself and personally use that hammer to bang those nails <laughs> in the ass. <laughs> bang the nails in the ass. Is that all? Not quite. The Chamberlain at the castle has the cross guard for Sir Radzik's sword, which I had engraved in Sassel. You want me to go and pick it up? All right. Money, charcoal, cross guard. Got it. And ale. <laughs> Stop off at the tavern on your way home. I know you'll be going there anyway to see that girl of yours. But make sure the ale's still cool from the cellar when you get back. Her name is Bianca. Right, so make sure Bianca draws me a nice cool one. Run along now. Work won't wait. Aaron boy jobs. Let me turn up the volume. It's like super quiet. Pater Noster, qui es in cellis. Sanctificetum nomen tu, veniat regnum tu, fiat voluntas tu. That should be good. Alright. We got a bunch of missions to do. I'll have to get something to eat. I'm starting I to get ate hungry. Some, I ate some cheese, dog. There, you cheesed up. Uh, taking care of like, uh, I'm really not good at survivalist stats. What's up, man? It is I, Henry. What's over here? There's a D over here somewhere. Who are you? 
Oh, you're the money guy. Give me my money. What do you want? Money. My father sent me to get the coin you owe him for the axe, hammer, and nails. You're trying to catch these hands? Nothing. Clear off. Oh. Yeah, we'll do what father said. I'm not trying to get my ass beat. For a lot more than just the axe and hammer. If he went to the bailiff about it, you'd be in deep water. At least pay for the tools if you can't pay for everything. I told you I have no coin, you bastard. Get the ah, hell out of here. You're about to catch us. Sometimes you need powers of persuasion to achieve your goals. When talking to people, you can often choose what kind of impression you want to make on them. You can simply use speech, which, however, is influenced by the reputation you have at the moment with the person you're talking to. In the Middle Age, status, social status was paramount, so the quality of your attire and how well groomed you are, together with your reputation, can make a big difference to how people respond to you. If you look dangerous, people will be afraid to cross you and will also be more willing to assign risky tasks to you. That's influenced mainly by your strength and the deterrent effect of your weapons and equipment. But other things are also taken into account, such as blood stains on your clothes. You can also sometimes rely on money to do the talking for you. You just have to be agreed to on a persuasive sum. Bribing people works on the same way as shopping. See trading and haggling. In special cases, you can try any other skill. E.g. example, horsemanship. It's not only the matter of persuasion that is important, but also the specific order, because sometimes it's not enough just to choose accordingly to your highest characteristics. You have to really read what you're going to say. Next page. But different approaches work on different people. You won't intimidate a tough brawler easily, and no matter how well you dress, you won't impress a nobility easily. There's... That's because Henry's abilities aren't simply assigned as a universal value, but compared with the abilities of his counterpart. You can see the values of the various abilities in the game under the corresponding icons. You can always see your abilities. Your counterpoint's abilities are visible to you if it's someone you know well or if you're skilled at reading people. Learn the perk Empathetic. Your money, the amount you pay. Total speech skill, total charisma, charisma skill, total strength skill. It's not just about stats though. The outcome of it is influenced by other factors. Example, your reputation, whether you're dirty or bleeding, etc. If you can't outdo the nimble tongue of a merchant, for example, you may want to poison him a little first, and then you will be easier to persuade. Or you, if you lead a guard away from his friends, he'll be easier to scare. The level of your reputation with your counterpart. Alright. I'm gonna beat your- I'm gonna beat his ass. <laughs> That's what's gonna happen. Hey, you drunkard. I must have misheard you. It sounded like you just told me to clear off. But you wouldn't be stupid enough to think you can steal, not pay your debts, and then try to scare me. Would you? You son of a whore. How dare you speak to me like that? Didn't your thieving father teach you any manners? No? Well, I'll teach you then. Let's sure. do it. Very well. Unarmed combat. Hook strong. Slower hand strike to the head. Jab, direct hand to blow to the face, kick, kick the opponent away, tab, lock onto opponent, switch to next opponent, left shick, shift unlock. Oh, these are a lot of controls. Q is block, raises hands, and holds hands in defense. Opponent, this indicator has, shows how roughly how much HP your opponent has left. The more wounded he is, the slower he'll attack and react. When the guard end is near, he may either try to flee or surrender. Your wounds. Icons that notify when you're wounded and or you're bleeding. If an opponent strike hits your armor or you block it, it will cost you stamina. When your stamina is depleted, you won't be able to defend yourself and will be wounded. Attacking will also deplete your stamina, especially when wielding a heavy weapon. Health. If you can't cover yourself badly and your armor is weak, strikes will wound you. Heavy wounds will lead to bleeding. Alright. <clears throat> Oh, you son of a... Ah, yeah, what's up? Sod it! Okay, he's beating my ass. Oh, you stop grabbing me. Ah. 
He's whooping my ass. Come here, Dilly. God dang it. Oh, God, block. You're going to cry now. Oh, I'm so not good at this. I'm getting Suck. my ass kicked. Keeps grabbing me. How do I do a grab? Oh, how does he do that weaving stuff, too? Come on, then. Missed. Oh, this is hard. All right, dang it. Ah, oh, he's so much better at fighting than I am. Yes, I win, I think. Enough, enough. I give up. Take what you want. It's not much, but it's all I have. You understand? That was hard. He kicked my butt. God, this dude's whooping my butt. Find something at Kunash's. Well, give me the axe. That's mine now. Thank you. What else you got? I ought to beat the crap out of you for beating me up like that. Punk. Got a candle. This is our candle now. Hammer nails. Where did you put the hammer and nails at, dude? I know you got them somewhere. Well, at least we won. God, he was kicking my butt, though. He's, like, grabbing me and stuff. I don't know how to do that. So we got the axe back from him. Hammer. Where's the hammer and nails at? Unless you want to catch these hands again, son. All right, blacksmith's boy, you got the better of me. Take what you want. You haven't heard the last. Hmm. I think it'd be somewhere near where we beat him up at. We found the axe. Is that the hammer? That kind of looks like a hammer. But it won't let me pick it up. Like a wooden hammer. Eat this chicken. Oh god! <laughs> we murdered it! Okay! So they won't be asking me about him beating him up. But I don't know where he's got the hammer and nails at, for real. Might have discovered the traitor, but that ain't what I'm looking for. Did I get my health back somehow? Oh my god, if I can't find these hammer and nails, I'm gonna get... Punch it. Ah, oh, there we go. There we go. That's the flavor you can savor. That's ours now. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, I don't think he's ready for that. Baron's wife. Hey, what's up? Huh? <laughs> I'm huh? hurt and it won't stop bleeding. Won't stop bleeding. Heal me. Oh, now. Stop squealing like a baby and show me that. Ah, she heals. She's a healer. There you are, good as new. Yay. You ought to learn to do that yourself. I should. 
Nice. She's awesome. The best. We discover charcoal burner from somewhere. How are you? Well. Let's talk trade. You first have to put put your purchases into the basket and then either confirm the purchase or haggle. I want to sell you the stuff I got. Hmm. What basket? You not want? Uh, do you not want my thing? Yeah, there we go. All right, and then how do I sell it? He's not gonna give me any money. I don't think. Uh, we'll sell it to somebody else. You don't seem like you're gonna give me any money for the things I'm trying to sell you. Give me those back. I'll go to somebody else that'll actually trade me. Hey, Pip! Do you want to learn something? Just come right up! God, these people are annoying. You want to pay? Let's talk trade. Do you want my thing that I'm trying to sell? There we go, he'll pay for it. I don't know if it's the price I'm looking for, but... Haggle! Can we do something about the price? Sure, why not? Haggling works both ways, whether you want to buy cheap or sell dear. You want to select the amount of money you want to pay or get the trader W and S to confirm with the E. The trade the trader will then respond to your offer. If the answer is a refusal, he or she will make a counter offer and wait for your response. Okay. This seems to have got a lot going on in it. If the slider can't be moved in one direction or the other, that means either you or the trader don't have enough money. Dragging out the haggling will, with one offer after another will gradually try the trader's patience and eventually they'll drop the haggling completely. You can see how close you're getting to the point from the trader icon below the bar. The more gold there is in the background, the closer the trader is to dropping the haggling. Every unsuccessful bout of haggling lowers your reputation with the trader. Okay. We want more money, right? Since it's you. That's better. Drop it a bit more and we'll call it a deal. Implements, instruments, and tools. No, oh, he's pretty upset about it. Tough luck. Oh shit, we lost. Damn it! Oh my god. What about you? Do you trade? Good day. God dang, I had a few. I think I learned a valuable lesson on that one, I think. God dang, he's like, get out of here, peasant. How dare you. Alright. I think this is what we're supposed to be doing anyways. I don't know if I'm supposed to be selling it or not, but I'm going to. Haggle. Let's have a word about the price. Sure, why not? I think he's not offering as much as the last time. Agree? Come on up and see. You won't convince me with that. Huh. Ooh, he does not want to haggle. Well, we'll just stick it. Very well, I agree. 
Dang, we lost point three. And now what am I supposed to do? Where's my quest? There's a lot of things that I'm not going to <laughs> read. <laughs> Holy crap. Alright, well we sold the hammer and stuff that we had. Where else am I supposed to go? I got my charcoal pointer already. You can't be serious, Torch. Insulting our king. What insult? I say only the truth. Sigismund has done only what he had to. Had to. He had to abduct the king. He had to lure his cousin Prokop into a trap and imprison him. He had to invade with his army of Tartars and besiege Kutenberg. Tartars. Not. What is this Wenceslas for a king? The empire is falling asunder in his hands. The German counts elected Ruprecht of the Palatinate as king because your Wenceslas would not go to their deeds even. German counts. Traitors. Now even the Pope God be with you, Henry. I'm with you, Matthew. What's going on here? Deutsche spouting shit. What? Just listen and you'll hear for yourself. Someone has to bring order and reunite the empire. <laughs> oh, he has startled the chicken. The Austrians. And nowadays, not even the devil himself can keep up with all the popes. Which is the rightful pope? The one in Rome or the one in Avignon? Do not blaspheme, Alex. No, it's true, though. Wenceslas is the king of Bohemia. Bohemian nobles are on his side. To hell with Rosenberg and his cabal. Sir Ratzik is Wenceslas' commander-in-chief. He stayed loyal to the king. And if he heard you talking like this, he would have you whipped like a dog. Your deal will soon have nothing left to rule. Jobs had to sell Luxembourg to help your king. South Bohemia is with Sigismund and... don't and forget about Kutenberg, where Germans like you kissed Sigismund's feet to keep their heads. Yes, but... Goodman Deutsch... This is pointless. Let us talk of more pleasant things. My words exactly. Deutsch has gone too far. Wenceslas is our rightful king. Hmm. Deutsch is an idiot. But what can you do? I might have an idea. Deutsch deserves to be taught a lesson. Doesn't he, Fritz? What? Too, I my view. Should give him a proper hiding. Are you mad? Do you want to end up in the pillory? Don't listen to Fritz. I've got a better idea. Nah, I'm not trying to be a Deutsch dickhead. Deutsch is talking such shit. It made me think of that huge parliament you You know, the one right next to his freshly whitewashed house. <laughs> you think we should redecorate for him? Count me in. Well, I'm good. I'd rather touch it, to be honest. But, doing some turns will do. What do you say, Henry? I'm good. But I was going to get ale for father and a, a few other things. We're finishing Sir Ratzik's sword. Come on. Doing a few handfuls of manure is not going to take all day. And it's our duty to defend the honor of our king. No, I'm good. So, how? Are you with us? No, I'm good. Do I get a choice? I won't do it. Sorry, fam. Not that I don't want to teach the Deutsche a lesson, but... I really don't have time. I'll lose well, my reputation. I don't care. Still, we can manage without you. Let's go, lads. Honestly, hell. How could you pass a good chance like this? Oh, everybody's freaking mad at me, apparently. Oh, well. Merchants mad at me. These people are mad at me. Everybody mad at me. Oh, I can't lockpick that. Well, I'm not trying to lockpick this thing. I'm so lost. May the Lord watch you. What are my, uh... Missions right now. What am I doing? Quest log. Uh, go to the sword fighting lesson. Well, not that yet. We're doing something else. What about the thing I'm doing with the? Di okay. Buy a bag of charcoal at the market. Pick up the cross guard at the castle. Buy L. Let's go to the sword fighting lesson. That sounds like fun. I want a sword fighting lesson. Are you the ale lady? Hey, Bianca, give me the ale. Save my lovely. You're looking well today. <laughs> you too, handsome. What brings you here? Ale. Just ale. <laughs> what else? <laughs> Just ale. From a village love. <laughs> <laughs> what will it be then, ragamuffin? 
I need ale for father. A pitcher as usual? Yeah, free if it oh. can be. Bring me a cool one from the cellar. <laughs> but of course. What a homie. Here you are. Thanks, fam. Thanks. It's on me today. <laughs> you can pay me back. <laughs> Out of the question. Here you go. And this evening I'll have something more for you. <laughs> I can't wait. Thanks. You'll have something to look forward to this evening. <laughs> you too. Oh, um, by the way, that shifty looking fellow was asking after you. What's wrong? Oh, we know him by name. I suppose. He's a man who makes his coin rubbing on his wayfarers. I'm sure of it. I'll be happy when he's gone for good. But what in heaven's name are you up to with him? I don't he know. promised to teach me how to use a sword. What use would that be to you? Enough. You sound just like father. I'll be going now. See you this evening. How? Uh -huh. I've got something special for you. Is that so? Now what would that be? Excuse me. Your favorite. Save your schnapps. Really? You're an angel. <laughs> I hope you'll thank me properly. Uh -huh. Ho ho. You bet I will. You already know. We got some save your schnapps. Saving the game. The game saves automatically. To save it immediately, drink Savior Schnapps. Oh, that's important. Oh, where are we going? We're going the wrong way. We need to find that shifty looking fellow so he can teach me about the sword. Ah, oh, there's the sword. Hail to the hero! Teach me. Have you recovered from yesterday's great wound? Oh, it was nothing. Except mother noticed and had a word or two to say about it. No Teach mother's me the happy sword. when the son starts to take an interest in swords. Where there's weapons, there's death. The question is, what do you want? I don't want to rot in this hole forever. I feel like I don't belong here. I want to live and see the world. The world's a dangerous place and I need to know how to protect myself. Spoken like a man. Hey. As it happens, today's your last chance. I have to leave. So, are you ready to get stuck in? Yes, let's do it. Yes. All right, I wait on the ground by the sheepfold as usual. Teach me the swordman. I'm just gonna follow him. I don't know where the sheepfold is. Is he gonna ride his horse? Oh, I was about to say, that's a real jerk move. I don't have a horse. Can you move? I'm gonna buy my charcoal while I wait for him. Alright, so we need 10 charcoal. I don't know if we got enough money for this, bro. Um, we need an aggle. Can we do something about the price? Alright. We gotta pay less, bro. We can't afford that. What about this? That's not enough. Come on, man. I need 10 of these things. Oh, I ain't got the money. I oh, will come back. I'll have to get some money from somebody. Why did I lose reputation? I guess because I didn't finish the haggle? I don't know. <sighs> I sold the hammer and things. I guess I'm about to sell something else. What's up, man? So, can we get started? Yeah, I'm ready. We can. Good. And since today's the last time we'll be seeing each other, you can show me everything I've taught you so far. Oh, with my hands? Very well. Let's start with faces. Keep moving. Your life depends on it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Alright, alright. Now try to hit me. You have to put your weight into your attack. If you just fiddle around, you'll get nowhere. Try slashing from different sides. Unpredictability is the key. Never repeat yourself. 
Ah, you used the mouse to shoot your direction. That's kind of cool. The blade is for stabbing. Tried a few times. Stab. Now you're getting it. All right. Not bad. Again. Good, good. Let's try something else. One strike, I can fend off without a sweat. But if you chain your strikes, I'll have a much harder time. As right, soon teach as you me. land one blow, follow it with another. I wish I would have known this when I was fighting the other dude. Very good. Now you're getting it. Not bad. Again. Yeah, we did it. We're a warrior. That's enough. I don't know about you, but I'm tired and thirsty. Remember, though, train hard. No one becomes a master swordsman overnight. You have to work and work. And the main thing is to use what you've learned in real combat. There's nothing better than experience, believe me. He's got like this cool Highlander sword. What do I have? I have nothing. I have shoes. I guess we're done with that. I wish you would have gave me some money. I need some money, dog. What all? What else do we gotta do for our quest? Hopefully that one guy will still trade with me, the damn trader dude. All right, so we need charcoal and we need the cross guard. God be with you, Henry. How are you selling charcoal for more than that stupid hammer and stuff was it worth? See if I have anything I could sell. You like chicken? What's it worth? You get forty. Ah, oh, this is worth a lot. Shaver Snaps is worth a ton. And she gave me five of them. Okay. Hey, well, I wish I would have known that the first time. I wouldn't have pissed him off. Dang, she's the best. She gave me something worth a ton of money. You don't have that much money, though. What happens if I, uh, I don't know. I'm just gonna take it out just to be safe. I don't want him stealing my stuff from me. Take everything out. I'll be back. I want to make sure I get my money's worth of that saver schnapps. For the kitchen or the field. How much money you got, homie? You like savory snaps? You look like a person that would like some savory snaps. Oh, he doesn't want savory snaps. He won't pay for it. Alright, dude. What about you? Uh, does anybody want savory snaps? I can afford it. Good luck. Alright, that'll work. Um, at least I can get the full amount for this one. And then we haggle if we can. If not, we'll Let's just have accept a word it. about the price. I come on up and take a look. I've got everything you need, day or night, at home or at work. Is this enough? A nice sum. Just lower your demands a little and we'll agree. All right. Come on up and take a look. I've got everything you need. Stay or not. He looks like he still wants to haggle a little bit. Aye. For that amount, I can be persuaded. Thanks, man. 
Alright, now we buy our charcoal. And I still have four saver snaps. Whatever that does, I probably won't use it too much, to be honest. Maybe I will. I don't know. Let's talk trade. Give me my charcoal. Dang, I didn't even have to beat that dude's butt then for all that. Oh, well. Still not trying to pay this dude price. full price if I can help it. Naturally. Ah, I've reached a new level in speech. Let's go. Since it's you, my speech leveled up. Little more and we'll call it a deal. Oh, I hate you. Aye, for that amount, I can be persuaded. Haggle everything. This is a really cool game, though. There's a lot of stuff you can do in different ways, and I like it so far. Let me see. I want to use my skills just because I feel like that's important. <laughs> I've leveled up a good bit, and I haven't really done anything. What does this do? Ah, uh, you can get more, but I can't level that up yet. Main level, I can... You'll last 30% longer without food. I like that, because I... But as soon as you... Oh, wait. No. When dirty, you'll have 50% more charisma with women. However, people will smell you from a mile off. It's reducing your cell skill. Your stamina will regenerate 20% faster at night. No, that's... All these have drawbacks. Increases the sight distance of your fast travel, so you s notice events on the way sooner, and you increase chances of invading them. I don't know what that is yet. You grew up in impoverished conditions, so comfy beds are inverted to you. The worse the bed, the better you sleep, and vice versa. All these main level skills suck. We'll just save that. I'm <laughs> this seems like something we could actually use. Yeah. And something else we had leveled up to our speech, I think he said. It's level two. Oh, I got leveled up more than that. My agility is almost leveled up too. Let's go. Okay. All right, so we got our bag of charcoal. Now we just got to talk to the flag bearer or whatever, color guard. In the castle, I would assume he'd be. Yeah, I was about to throw poop at somebody's house who I don't necessarily disagree with. Everything he said sounded right from the opening cutscene. Sounds like the king was just a... You, Henry? I'm doing good, man. How are you, Catchpole? What a name. <laughs> Old Catchpole the Great. What's up? I need stuff. Do I need to go in there to do it? Yeah, I do. Here for the colors. I'm with you. I'm with you, Henry. I want to be a knight. How are you? I came for the cross guard. I ain't snitching. Father sent me. We're forging a sword for Sir Radzik, and the Chamberlain has the cross guard and pommel. Father had them engraved in Sasau. Right. They're here. The Chamberlain gave them to us for you. We looked them over. Beautiful work. I've never seen anything so fine. I can't wait to see the sword. Just make sure you don't botch it. When did I ever botch anything? <laughs> Where should I start? <laughs> ah, shut up and give me what I want or I'll kick your ass this evening. Right away, your lordship. Thanks, man. Magnificent. Shame I can't keep the sword for myself. Well, I better go if we're to get the job done by this evening. Godspeed. See you later in the tavern. You certainly will. After today's work, the ale might even be on me. Yay. Alright, we've done all our things. Mission achieved. You learned town garrison. Alright, we're done, I guess. Is there anything else? You can find all information about the quest log. Oh, well, it's too late to tell me that now, except for the map thing. I haven't used the map yet. What is this? No, no, no. No, we don't want to do that, because I don't even know what that is. Hello, Fazer. I brought these. About the things yeah, you wanted. About time. Have you got everything I wanted? What do you mean about time? I have charcoal, the hilt, and the ale. We can start. Good job. Let's have it then, son. Hey, I'm a good son. With that ale, it's as flat and warm as horse piss. 
go back and get me another, and you can pay for it yourself. What? That's the price of stupidity. What do you mean? Oh, I went to the... Oh. Bah. I guess I did things in the wrong order. Whatever. Not like I didn't pay for everything in the first place, because god dang, the drunker dude's hammer and stuff that he gave me wasn't worth nothing. God dang it. Eat this chicken. Fill my fury. I don't know why we're collecting these chickens for, but why not? Hey, I'll let the animal get one. Hey, you too. I'm back. I'm back. see that. What's the matter? I need another pitcher of ale. The last one wasn't cold enough for father. You want me to get it for you? No, I'll pay for I, it. And a smile from you. <laughs> God be with Do, 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 do. Thank you. Thanks. It's on me today. <laughs> You can pay me back this evening. Out of the question. Oh, same cutscene again. again. And this evening I'll have something more for you. <laughs> I can't wait. I'm not gonna say anything about the douche. <laughs> I might as well have the Don't conversation. Off again. Oh, don't talk to me about him. He's a good customer. But when it comes to politics, he's unbearable. The number of times I had to throw him and the others out so they wouldn't start brawling. Hmm. Well, I'd say he's an exceptional forum today. Hey. That's Alex. That's not the douche. Dutch. Do Dutch. How do you say it? Dutch. Su Gotta give up. <laughs> do hmm. The do. Douche. I don't know. Oh, I'm fading out. I wonder if I can die from doing that. Yeah, you about to taste these hands. I got the about time. Have you got everything I wanted? Yeah, I guess. I have charcoal, the hilt, and the ale. We can start. Good job. Woo. Let's have it then, son. Well done. Right, let's see what kind of job the master and Sasal did for us. <laughs> Look at that lad. That's mm. what I call crusty. Pretty cool. What does the inscription mean? Dandavino. Doesn't look like Czech to me. Latin, maybe? Celtic. Lord maybe. Radzig I don't ordered know. it. Speak the Latin. The finest sword I've ever made. We got the charcoal. Good. And fire up the forge. We'll put it all together. Yay! Smithing side quest. Bonding time. By the way, I heard some gossip about what happened to Deutsch. I didn't do I it. I expect you know Deutsch. something about it. That's how you say it. Maybe. Maybe. Someone threw dung at Deutsch's freshly lime-washed house. It wasn't me. And maybe those cronies of yours had something to do with it. That Deutsch was talking treason in the tavern about Sigismund. I didn't do it. He got what he deserved. Oh, got what he deserved, did he? Bro, I didn't do it. Look, I don't know if you're mixed up in this or if it's just those friends of yours. It's all the same to me. But I have a trade to run. The German pays well. And having my son in the pillory helps nothing and nobody. Least of all the king. Do you understand? Yes. Look me in the eye, Henry. Hey, I didn't do it. Do you understand? I understand. <laughs> Good. Then we'll never have this conversation again. Well, so you think it's right to let traitors speak ill of the king? Is no that king of mine. Listen to a word I say. So Deutsch spouts with you. So what? You might win a fight with violence, but you'll never win an argument. Remember, Henry, if you want to convince someone that they're wrong, try using your mouth, and not your fists. Ah, ask the other guy that I got the axe and stuff from. Which one worked better? 
Yeah. The furnace is ready. Right, we'll do the grip. I'll heat it up, and when I take it out, you slip the grip on so it fits exactly. You know what you're doing. I'm an expert and a professional. If I knew I was going to get in trouble anyways, Dude. I would have dang... <laughs> do the poop. Nah, I don't know if he deserved the poop to be thrown. Good. Once more. Push! Push! That's it. Done. Now file it down so it sits well in the hand. I'll prepare the guard. Hmm. There can be only one Highlander. Father, why did you leave Prague? Who ever heard of a master swordsmith making horseshoes in a village? <laughs> I had my reasons, Hal. And here I have your mother and you. Why would I want any other life? Do you remember Emperor Charles? I do. Life was good under his reign. Better than now. He built half of Prague and a score of castles, had a bridge Excuse made me. over the Moldau, and founded a university. And all without a war, he knew how to rule. Better than Wenceslas. Better by far. But Wenceslas doesn't have it easy. It's hard to step into the shoes of someone whose like is born only once a thousand years. What about Sigismund? Do you think Charles would have brought an army down on his own people like Sigismund? No. Wenceslas may not be the equal of his father, but Sigismund, he brings shame to the royal name. Okay, so Sigismund is a bad guy. Looks good. Give it here, and we'll put it all together. Push! Oh, that's awesome. You did good stuff. And we shall name it Excalibur! It's magnificent. Indeed it is. The Lord be with you. My father sent me for those nails. What nails? Can I walk his ass? They're ready. Will you fetch them for me, Hal? They're in the trunk in the living room. So, dong. I can jump, man. I would have done a jump and front kick on that one dude if I knew I could jump. In that whole dude's career, bro. You got any more food? I'm hungry, probably. Apples. Can I take those? Yeah, I love apples. Apples are good. Oh yes. Oh yes, apple fiend. Give me them apples. Oh, tons of food. Oh my god. <laughs> Watch this. She's going to be trying to make an apple pie or something. And I'm taking all the... Does it matter if I'm taking all this stuff? Am I starving my own family by doing this? Or does it matter? I don't know. I'll give it back if she asks about it. You've eaten too much. You won't be hungry for a longer time now, but you'll be clumsy until you digest it. Oh, I didn't know I wasn't hungry. Should I take this? No, let's leave it. I don't want to take everything. I'm not trying to be that guy. Okay, where's the nails at? Lord. Oh, I don't have a lockpick. Where, where did we put the nails? What do you say the nails were at? Quest. Is this even my house? It has to be, I think. I think I might be in the wrong house. No, no, no. This is the right house because the A is moving so much. It has to be the right house. 
Hey, where's the nails at? Henry, what do you need, son? Nothing, I don't guess. Bye. Nails. It's nail time. Oh, there we go. Probably take all this stuff, right? With thing one minute, we'll add 30 health and dispel hangover effects. Okay. I don't know why I wouldn't take that stuff. As long as they don't get mad at me. If they get mad at me for taking the stuff, I'm gonna feel kind of bad. <laughs> Alright, I got your nails. Here are those nails you Henry, wanted. What are you waiting for? Thanks. Bring those nails. So, how's Bianca? Me yelling at me while I'm She's giving fine. her the nails. Why'd you ask? <laughs> Just wondering. Will you be going to the dance this evening? We will. Oh, she wants... She's trying to make moves. Maybe we'll see each other there. Anyway, mustn't keep you. Here? I'll be on my way. That sword is truly beautiful. She was trying to make moves on me. Ah, that cloth. Booty. Hey, you shouldn't be Fine, looking. You're old. <laughs> now, stop staring at her and come and see this. It's time for the trial by fire. Now we're going to cut it in half. Oh! He's going to miss, and then I'll do it. Oh, let me do it. <laughs> we did a fine job. That we I'll did. I expect nothing less from such a renowned swordsmith. He got a weird wart on his face. Gone, sir. Hmm. You haven't lost your skills, though. Yeah! Watch out. Ah, oh, he's like a dang ninja. Would you like to try it? Hell yeah! So good as a sword to a commoner. Try it. Hey. Am I gonna get in trouble? God, we suck! You still have a lot to learn. Thanks, man. Ask your father to show you how. He knows what he's about. Learning his trade will serve him better in life, sir. Perhaps. But who knows what the future holds for each of us. I see that you almost have it finished. If it just needs a polish, then Henry will bring it to you. Excellent. Fine work, very fine. A sword such as this will bring honor to its bearer. What say you say, Svan? True, Sir Radzik. If I'd have had its like back in Nicopolis, things would have worked out differently. Huh. Oh. Odd to find such an accomplished swordsmith working in a place like this. A man of his talent would have no problem making a fortune in Prague or Vienna. You're right. It's a very long and peculiar story. I'd be glad to listen to it over a cup of wine, but duty calls and I must leave. See you, fam. Here you are. Learn from your father. He truly is a master of his craft. I'm sure our paths will cross again. I'm sure they will. Once it's ready, send your son up to me with it. Good work, Martin. Sure. It's been an honor, say it's fun. Have a safe journey to Sassau. The honor is mine, Sir Radzik. Thank you for the hospitality. Hmm. A long, peculiar history. That was a long time ago. I might tell you about it sometime, but not today. Will you teach me how to use it, like Sir Radzik said? Why? Well, it could come in useful. Maybe I'll travel a bit before settling down. I'd like to know more than the tavern on the green in the forge. Huh. You know the trouble with an adventurous life, son? It can end before it gets started. I might hmm. teach you how to handle a sword, and then someone will shoot you with a crossbow as soon as you set foot outside the house. Huh. You talk as if you've seen it happen. A man my age has seen a lot. Being a blacksmith might bring no glory, but it has its benefits, like keeping your head on your shoulders. I want to end my days in Scalitz, here, beneath the linden tree, and by your mother's side. Well, so do I, one day. But first, I'd like to see the world, meet new people. Meet them, or beat them? Meet. 
Do you have to keep going on about it? <laughs> then you've no need to learn swordplay. Ah, who are you? Ah, something's amiss. A messenger. messenger. He was in a hurry. What's happened? Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, hail. Ah, oh, it's the king of what's his name? The one we don't like. Go get him, Dutch. Dutch. Oh, we're screwed. Huh. Why? Why are they attacking our little outlier of a town? Oh, hell, get out of here, run! Listen to me, Al. Listen carefully. Take the sword, go into the house, and grab anything else important from the trunk. Go to the castle. Hurry, what about you? Oh, it's crap. Your mother is in the village. I'll fetch her and we'll follow right behind. I'll go with you. No. You'll do what I say right now. Give the sword to Sir Redzik. If anything happens, he'll take care of you. He owes me. Oh, this sucks. Oh, everybody's dying. Messing up everybody, let's go. Come on, run. Oh no, he's about to get horse smacked. Watch out. Oh no. Ah. Uh. Happy, peaceful village life. You're gonna die, Baldy. I'm just letting you know. You're gonna die. Might not be today. Might not be tomorrow. But I'm gonna get that ass. Come on, Hal! You can still make it! Run! Find a horse! Ride to town, Berg! What? Oh, damn, I can get my sword. guys well that's a good ending to part one um yeah i'm gonna be doing this series and i'm also gonna be as usual checking out like indie games and doing walkthroughs of those as well but i want to play through this game because it actually it seems pretty dope so far i hear it's super hard um but i'm gonna try to get to the end of it but yeah if you like videos like these please like and subscribe and 
as always, I'll see you next time. Bye!